Guess who's back? Back again. I'm back. Hello, welcome back to the theater. I have way too much energy for someone who didn't sleep the greatest. I also had some really weird dreams where my bosses from Blind Channel, like the older generation, were some sort of like organized crime people. I don't know. I didn't get like the specifics of it enough in my dream, but I got enough to be like, well, there's something sketch going on here. We weren't in Blind Channel. We were in like some weird kind of deserted city. I don't know. It was strange. Anyways, that was what I woke up from and still trying to piece it together. I'm here again, obviously. We've got the chairs out still. Oh no, my battery's about to die. I have not planned for this. I have everything in my idiot bag but a new battery. Okay, let's go quick. And I also painted this yesterday. I think it's good to go. It looks so much nicer than it did yesterday. I think I might have to redo parts of this wall or just like the whole rounded part. And then I have the trim here and over there to do. But yeah, battery is flashing like crazy, so I'm gonna go have a breakfast drink and then get started in there. Well, hello, I am back home now. Of course, I've changed out of my work clothes. I still have like some paint drips here and my battery's about to die. Forgot about that. But yeah, so I'm a little bit covered in paint still. I was like scrubbing the sink that I've been cleaning my brushes out of because it was real bad. Um, but now it's really good. But as a result, the splashing got all over me. That's fine. So it is two o'clock. I think I just mentioned that. Uh, my mom picked me up and she had some errands to run. She had to go to Canadian Tire to get some uh, plant potters, plant pots, pots for her plants. Uh, and I just stayed in the car and then I ended up seeing one of my friends, my walking buddy slash hiking buddy. And I was like, listen, if you ever, I'm like, how, what, what are you doing for quarantine? Not staying home all the time? Not okay. Well, if you want to go for a hike, <laughs> let's do that. So that's potential excitingness coming my way, maybe. He, he went out fishing yesterday and he was showing me his terrible burn. That's gonna be a tan, because he tans really well that he got, though, because he was wearing his sunglasses so and his hat, so it's like just white here and red here. <laughs> and then he's got a massive beard. But anyways, it was really funny. So ah, that'll be fun. I don't feel like the only idiot for having like an awkward tan. So yeah, anyways, I'm home now. I've had lunch and I'm really excited because today is the first day in forever that I can um, embroider so that's cool I mean I could have embroidered but I just felt like no I can't embroider because I need to wind all these bobbins but that's all behind me now and I'm excited about that although there are a few things that I need to do that I've been putting off I need to fold my laundry and it is the 28th of the month and I have moved my footage for my June intro onto my computer off my hard drive, but I have not gone through it at all. So I need to do that at some point very shortly here, but I worked Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday this week instead of Tuesday, Wednesday, Friday. So that means that I have all of tomorrow that I normally wouldn't. Of course, normally I'd have today, but it's it's fine. Um, I don't work again until probably Tuesday next week. So got a nice four day weekend going on. It's supposed to rain this weekend too. So it'll be old lady time with my embroidery and maybe some sewing because I have some masks I wanna make before I go to Blind Channel, and I also want to make scrunchies. <laughs> Anyways, I'm going to stop rambling because I feel like I've been rambling forever, or maybe it's just because I'm talking really fast. It could be because I'm talking really fast. I have caffeine. And um, just chill for a bit, <laughs> and then see what, see what stuff I can get up to. I have so many fans going on in this room and I'm sorry if you can hear them, but it's a nice good temperature. It is also like 24 degrees outside right now and I know I said I was going to wait for it to cool down, but it's not really cooling down. It looks like it's going to be a couple hours before it even drops to 20, so I think once the vlog finishes exporting, which is what it's doing right now, and I get it uploading, I'm going to get changed. I'm going to go for a walk. I was thinking about going in my shorts, but thigh rubbing but I mean I do have that bomb should I go in shorts I don't know I think what I might do though in the future is I have my capri sweatpants and I think I might cut them up to like closer to the knee and hem them because then it'll be a little bit cooler also I need to fix the pocket in them anyways because I guess when they were getting so in the serger missed part of the pocket so that's where we're at anyways yeah I think I'm gonna start getting changed now because this is gonna be a couple minutes to export and then I'll be good to go right away. Gonna stop drinking water also because I have this thing where I'm like, yeah, I gotta hydrate so I don't, 
like melt when I go outside and then I go outside and I'm like I gotta pee <laughs> TMI I know but anyways that's I just want to update so I'm gonna figure out what I want to wear and then get changed I suppose so I'm ready to go I am back from my walk I am bright red again I should have probably worn a hat today because it was pretty sunny, but I didn't. So hopefully chugging copious amounts of water and such will prevent me from getting heat stroke because I'm pretty sure that's what happened when I went out when it was like 27 degrees. It was, it was only 24 today, so I have that in my favor. I'm just going to chug this and when I'm done this, maybe have another one and then I'm going to jump in the shower because I'm super sweaty. Also, update with the shorts and using like the, the no rub balm. It lasted pretty well for like the first half of my walk and then I think it was just it was too hot and it was melting so I think I'm gonna do the uh, mod modifications <laughs> Wow I could not figure out this that word on my sweatpants so they can be like at the knee shorts because that's the thing like I struggle to find shorts that go to your knee like everyone is like hey how high can we go and I'm like no <laughs> anyways I'm like I said gonna drink this watch a YouTube video have a shower and then it's probably gonna be time to feed myself because my mom's working till like 10 o'clock tonight because Superstore is back to regular hours so they're open till 10 again so yeah I'm not eating dinner at 10 o'clock so they're gonna get pizza for dinner tonight speaking of and tangent I saw so many panic not panico Domino pizza delivery vehicles going past me going back to Domino's pizza like within probably 10 minutes I saw three going back to the store and one coming away from it that's insane. Everybody's ordering pizza, I guess, today. Oh my goodness, my body is starting to feel the effects of all the walking. I think it's tired. I am tired. It is 8 o'clock and um, I've eaten dinner now. I showered, I changed, I laid down for a bit because I'm very tired, but I need to do invoicing. So as much as I want to just kind of do nothing, <laughs> I'm going to do invoicing now and get out of the way. And then that's really the only thing that I like need to need to do today. I definitely have a bunch of stuff on in my agenda for today, but because... I work today, normally I work Friday like I said earlier, because I went into work today, I obviously didn't have as much time, so I'll just do a bunch of that stuff tomorrow, I guess. I don't know, I'm like so tired. So hopefully invoicing isn't terrible, I'm sure it will be, <laughs> and um, I can finish it quickly and then uh, just chill, just chill. This girl is getting sleepy. <laughs> it is quarter to 11. Uh, my mom just really pretty recently got home from work because she worked until 10. Her boyfriend got called into work. So he has to spend the night on the other side. So um, he went and got pizza. He ate half the pizza and then he left the other half of the pizza for my mom. So even though they didn't get to have dinner together, they had the same dinner. But I've just been sitting up here watching Psych and working on this, which I love. It's so stupid. Um, but I can't, I can't get good tension on this fabric. I'm pretty sure it's the fabric. I don't think it's the hoop. And I was thinking about, like, my initial plan was to fill everything in, but I think I'm not going to because it's just, it's such a pain. So, like, yeah, the tension, like, even just right now I'm feeling in, like, the tension is so off. But I'll finish doing the Eiffel Tower in the gray, which is what I have there, and then I'll probably do the green grass, and then I gotta do Buddy's chest hair. I wasn't gonna do the chest hair until I decided if I want to fill it in or not, and now because I've decided I'm not going to, I can do that. And then if I want to do this again, I'll do it on better fabric, but you know what can you do? So I think I'm gonna go to sleep here shortly. My room is still like just a disaster. You can't really see because it's dark, and that's probably a good thing, but I have big plans for tomorrow, which include making my room not a disaster, uh, doing another load of laundry, I think, and um, organizing my stationary tower here. I want to make this bin or cupboard shelf, shelf, that's what it is. I want to make this shelf for my embroidery stuff because right now, as you can see, it's a disaster. Honestly, everything's a little bit of a disaster at the moment, but that's fine. Tomorrow we will get things back in ship shape or at least close to. And um, I think I wanna make masks tomorrow slash scrunchies. I'm more interested in scrunchies if we're being honest. Um, but yeah, so that is the plan for tomorrow is to get everything in order and then hopefully make some scrunchies and obviously do some embroidery and maybe do some writing and go for a walk and I just like I just, just like, yeah 
yeah, and set up some more hoops, even though I still, I still have, like, these ones, the D20s that I have not got to. They're set up. I just need to actually stitch them, but winding the bobbins for three days took up a lot of time, and then I started this, and I just want to finish this now because I'm getting so mad at the fabric, so I just want to get it done with, so that's fun. Anyways, I'm going to stop rambling. I'm going to change my PJs, and I'm going to go to sleep, so with that, I'll likely see you tomorrow. <laughs> Good night. <laughs>